the great day is here then, the maiden flight of the Dynam A10 Thunderbolt or Warthog. My friend Steve is going to maiden it for me and let's see how we get on. RF signal low. RF signal low. Yeah. Hang on. I'm going to bring it in. Okay. <laughs> She's down. <laughs> well done, Steve. Nice save. That's better. There's the there's the undercarriage up. Right, let's have a low pass. Come on, baby. No. It flutters a little. You know? Yeah. Can you see it fluttering a bit? Whippling, that's hands off. Right? right. Hands off, that's brilliant. Right, we'll try a glide. That's okay. Didn't dip, didn't drop out the sky. <laughs> the only trouble with a jet is don't glide them too long because once they lose, it takes a while for the fans to spool up and push yeah. power out. It takes a half a second or two. You don't get the instant power back as you do with a bat with a with a, a propeller. So don't glide for too long unless you're landing. Lovely. Nice. Right, that's on full bore. One minute, RF signal low. Wheels down. We do a circuit. Come on, baby. Nicely done, Steve. Landed it. Nicely Landed done. It My thanks then go to Steve for an excellent maiden flight. I hope to have the experience to be able to fly the thing myself in the not too distant future. They've been telling me it flies silky smooth and uh, it shouldn't be a problem, we shall see. Definitely there is a problem though with the Spectrum receiver, the RF signal dropping out there, almost lost the plane on the on the first flight. Uh, excellent recovery there by Steve. If anybody has any ideas what's happening there with the Spectrum receiver and the iRange X module combination, please leave me a comment below. Also very pleased with the performance of the graphene batteries I got from Hobby King. They performed excellently, very very happy with those. Very low internal resistance when I check them, only one or two milliohms. If you missed the build video, there'll be a link up on the top of the screen there now for you to check it out. And as always, thanks for watching.